Welcome to today's video, where we will be discussing the Unreal Editor for Fortnite Creative 2.0. Fortnite Creative 2.0 is an innovative game mode that allows players to build their own islands, create custom game modes, and share their creations with others. And the Unreal Editor is a powerful tool that makes all of this possible. In this video, we will be taking a closer look at the Unreal Editor and how you can use it to create your own custom islands and game modes in Fortnite Creative 2.0. What is Unreal Editor for Fortnite? Known as UEFN for short, Unreal Editor for Fortnite is a free application available now on the Epic Game Store, which seeks to massively improve the tools players have at their disposal for creating new games and experiences within Fortnite Creative Mode. Running on Unreal Engine 5 with several of the engine's most touted features, such as the Lumen Lighting technology that was introduced with Fortnite Chapter 4 last December, UEFN has been whispered about for months as Creative 2.0, a name that now proves a bit redundant given Epic's parallel unveiling of Creator Economy 2.0, which we'll get to further down in this article. With UEFN, anyone can design, develop, and publish their own custom experiences directly into Fortnite Creative Mode. The app is launching in a public beta state and coexists with Fortnite's legacy creative toolset, making it essentially an enhancement of those earlier tools rather than a wholesale replacement of them. UEFN uses a new programming language created by Epic called Verse, which the studio took time to outline during its State of Unreal 2023 presentation from GDC. Players will need to get acquainted with Verse, though the live demo seemed to suggest it's relatively intuitive compared to some other programming languages, which historically have been one of the major barriers preventing some would-be creators from realizing their game dev dreams. Creator Economy 2.0 not to be confused with the commonly used fan name for UEFN, Creative 2.0. The Creator Economy 2.0 is a remodeling of how creators within the Fortnite ecosystem will earn money for their work. Previously, players could enter a creator code when buying in-game items such as a seasonal battle pass, skins, and emotes. Creator codes were provided by Epic to certain players, streamers, and content creators. However, that only helped creators if players remembered to manually enter their code when making purchases, though entering it just once would keep it there for future purchases unless otherwise undone by the player. With Creator Economy 2.0, Epic is revising how players get paid. Moving forward, 40% of the money made from in-game purchases will go into an engagement pool to be paid out to eligible creators, including independent creators' islands, and Epic's own islands like Battle Royale. Those eligible include players age 18 or older whose Fortnite accounts are at least 90 days old. UEFN launched on March 22, 2023. It's a free application that anyone can use on the Epic Game Store. With UEFN, you can create a map or modes and send it straight to Fortnite Creative Mode. It's also worth mentioning that this isn't the first time someone has decided to recreate the original map. In 2021, Fortnite content creator, The Boy Dilly took it upon themselves to make the Chapter 1 Season 2 map, but the significant difference between this recreation and the most recent was that this one was made with Creative 1.0. Epic's Picks, UEFN Launch Experiences To help introduce players to the potential of UEFN, Epic has worked with several creators to showcase a few projects on launch day. Players can head into Fortnite's Discovery tab in-game and find several new UEFN-made projects under a banner titled Epic's Picks. UEFN has finally arrived after months of speculation. For some players, these new tools should help them expand their creativity and more seamlessly earn money for their work. But for the Fortnite community as a whole, which Epic said includes 70 million monthly active users, this may well prove to be a major reimaging of what is often considered a battle royale game first and foremost, as Epic wasn't shy about using the term metaverse during its 2023 GDC keynote presentation. It's clear that Epic sees player-driven content as a battleground in the next 10 years and beyond, with platforms and companies such as Roblox, Meta, and more all competing to be the name in virtual hangout spaces and all-in-one platforms of the future. Epic is betting big on Fortnite to keep its lead over the competition. How to access the Unreal Editor in Fortnite Creative 2.0? To access the Unreal Editor in Fortnite Creative 
you will need to first launch Fortnite and select the creative mode. Then, select the island you want to edit and click on the Island Settings button. From there, you can select the Start Island Editor button, which will launch the Unreal Editor using the Unreal Editor. Once you're in the Unreal Editor, you'll have access to a wide range of tools and features that allow you to create your own custom islands and game modes. You can use the built-in assets and tools provided by Epic Games, or you can import your own custom assets and textures to create something truly unique. The Unreal Editor also has a visual scripting tool called Blueprints, which allows you to create custom game logic and interactions without having to write any code. This makes it easy for anyone to create custom game modes and experiences in Fortnite Creative 2.0. The Unreal Editor is a powerful tool that allows Fortnite players to create their own custom content in Fortnite Creative 2.0. Whether you want to create your own custom island, game mode, or even a full-fledged game, the Unreal Editor has everything you need to bring your ideas to life. So what are you waiting for? Get creative and start building in Fortnite Creative 2.0 with the Unreal Editor. That's all for today's video. Thanks for watching.